Hello everyone, thank you for joining us. I hope you're all well. Okay, so this is Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. And um, as you can see, I've had a little bit of practice. And my character's just overwhelmed with joy, excitement. And uh, yeah, he just, um, he can't get enough, can he? Got a tattoo as well. So yeah, Ultimate Fishing Simulator 2. Um, anyway, right, so let's, um, let's get back to it, shall we? So how do I get out of this little cutscene? Uh, right, so we'll keep that. Okay, so I did play a game, um, at some point recently where the DLC was something like £900. Um, but this one has been gifted to me. And um, it's much cheaper. So thank you very much, Frankie. Um, I think it's better looking as well. Um, but what I'll do, I'll play the game for a little bit. And then I'll um, I'll say what the price is. So I'm not very good with this rod. I'm not actually very good at the game, to be honest. Um, yeah, I don't understand it. <clears throat> but that's because I don't know how to fish. Okay. So um, we'll get... We'll keep that and uh, let's have a look around the map, shall we? So I think if I press one, yeah, it goes away. Right. So on this map, we've got lots of different areas that we can fish. So there's this little kind of secluded bit here. Um, and then there's this bit over here. Donk. I've done that so many times. Um. Yeah, so this is good as well. And I don't think we can get up there, but obviously we're going to try it, aren't we? So yeah, it's a fishing game and I think there's boats in it. So I'm not playing the other game anymore because I just can't, can't do it. I'm all right at the game i can catch fish on there but what i can't do is promote games with that kind of uh dlc it's just disgusting right and then we've got this bit as well so let's go around here and see whether i can make it up there somehow anyway i hope you're all well hope you're all having a good one we can jump on this so we can skip along. Yeah, another fishing spot here. And you can go to the map and um, teleport to different parts. Anyway, so um, you can change the weather on this as well. So let's put night time and a storm. Perfect. There we go. Have we got a torch? We have. So yeah, we can be out in the pissing down rain. And what I want to check quickly was are there effects of the rain on the water no there's not deeply saddened I was expecting there to be so the graphics are on max yeah can't see anything um, so let's have a quick look in the uh, shop so you've got um, you can buy packages um, fish and sex and it looks like they're on offer so yeah there's that stuff rods so you've got all of these reels we're only at level one i haven't played it for long lines floats so this probably all makes a lot more sense to the people that are watching leaders Bottom and feeder, sinkers, hooks, baits. So, yeah, lots of different baits. Is that an apple? Oh no, it's a pea. Be a bit big, wouldn't it? Cherry, fly, dragonfly. Oh, poor things. I like dragonflies, leech, snails, all sorts. Um, we've got 
these there are loads of that and apparently this is all real stuff but I don't know I haven't got a clue weight and accessories so yeah um, let's exit the location so I did the tutorial and um, yeah it was quite a good guide but let's see whether I can go somewhere else now uh, oh so we'll have a quick look through the um, different areas okay Slovakia um there Russia Alaska oh Alaska's coming soon okay so this isn't a demo I've got the um whole game and it looks like we're gonna have to go back here again doesn't it so we'll do clear sky and um right while that's loading up oh it's really quick okay I'll be back in just a moment okay sorry about that so I just wanted to quickly check the price so it's normally £15.49. There is some DLC, but the first one that I can see is only 36 pence. Um, so I can't see it being a yeah, um absolute con like the other one. Anyway, <clears throat> so um yeah, £7.74 today. And then from the 14th of July onwards, £15.49. So if this is your kind of game and uh yeah you like this little preview then you can pop over and have a look um but obviously yeah like i've said i'm not a fisherman so maybe watch some other people's reviews of the game to see whether it's yeah right for you okay so this is a um float and we've got some bread on the end of it so let's see if we can reel it in with a fish on the end That'd be good, wouldn't it? I really want to get the boat. Nope, lost it. Oh, and also you can go under the water. You can actually have a look at what's happening. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, a little kind of underwater drone. And I think you can zoom in and out with, yeah, with the arrow key so you can have a proper look around. Anyway, yeah, so... Oh, no! That's it. Perfect. <laughs> He's so unimpressed, isn't he? He's just dead inside. What's he looking at? Yeah, so I, I hope that they uh, they fix that somehow. And uh, yeah, I didn't put an earring on him. I don't think I actually chose the character at all. But there he is with a little fish. Okay, so we're going to release that because it was only a dollar. Right, you need to stop jumping, Johnny. So cast out as far as possible-ish. Obviously, if we had a better rod, I would have uh, blitzed it. Come on now. And I've got this on, I think, normal or casual mode. You can put it on realistic. And I think you'd get less bites and possibly... Uh, some other differences as well to make it more realistic. Oh, we've got one. Perfect. Uh, release. Yeah, so you can change the drag um, over on the right there using the plus and minus. Um, you can change the leader length. As you can see, so it's changing now. So we could go right down to two and a half meters but obviously that's just going to hit the uh 
hit the thing there, I presume. Anyway, right, so let's try, um, let's try that and just plopping it in. See if we can actually see the fish. My goodness, that went a lot further than I thought it would. Come on now. Yeah, so this isn't the best game to be playing on YouTube, really, is it? But I thought I'd give it a try, a little review. But like I said, um, yeah, if you're considering buying a game, watch a review of someone playing the game who actually does the thing. Not an idiot. Fail. I quite like the reflections. Yeah, I think the graphics are good. The trees could do with a little bit of work. I don't know what I'm doing. Is it still... Yeah, we've still got some bread on there. My goodness, what was that shadow? My god. Right, here we go. Go, Jolly, go. Oh, we got one. Okay, release. Right, so let's try some different bait on it. So back to the shop, uh, equipment, we're using this rod at the moment, that's why it's highlighted. So you can rename them, so uh, Rod Stewart and uh, Maggie. Okay, so you can, um, yeah, change your kit about if you've got the stuff. So obviously we've got some different bait. So we've either got bread, bread, or earthworm. So, um, yeah, we'll have one of the gyms on there. And let's give this a try with a bit more. There we go. So a meter. I don't know. Worth a try. And it? Trial and error. Let's see what happens. Right. Earthworm gym. Mine. Nice. Pretty fish. Um, yeah, so you can hide the thing so you can have a look at the fish. And I think you can do other things as well. Uh, but I don't know. Right, so we're finally at level two. So does this mean we can go to a different map? I think it does. Uh, so exit location. So the load speed is really good, I think. Um, go fishing. Oh, for goodness sake, we need level three. Um, I'll be back in a moment. Okay, so I did a little bit of work in the background. We're now at level 36 with uh, 15.4 thousand. And um, yeah, I bought some stuff from the shop as well. So let's, um, let's go straight to Thailand, shall we? So I've unlocked all of these. Obviously, I'm going to be honest about it. I've completely cheated um, my way up. So, uh, yeah. But seeing as I've got the game in full, if anyone wants any specific combination tried, just let me know and, um, yeah, I'll sort it out. So, I've got a big rod. Um, but let's get back to the game. So, uh, equipment um, and we'll make one in slot. Three. Okay, so uh, we'll go for this one, this one, um, and we'll we'll go for the salt fighter, fifty five hundred, um, and we'll go for uh, the f no, we'll go for the mono. 
I've no idea what any of this means. Um, that's no good, is it? So let's go back to the shop and buy a leader. Uh, equipment. No. Shop. Leader. And yeah, this one. That's the one that I wanted. Oh, no. What's all this? Uh, right, we'll go for that one. Leader. Bye. Okay. Equipment. Oh, no. Right. Is it that one? Eight kilogram. One kilogram. Oh, I don't understand any of this. Strength, eight kilogram. We'll go for that one. Um, With the bait, we'll have some... We'll have some liver, shall we? Shark. Perfect. Okay, so select that. And do we need anything else? Why is it not? Can't select this item. Oh, I'm on a shark. Um, wait, I think I know why. It's the wrong rod, isn't it? We'll get there. We'll go for this one then. Yep. Oh, bugger it. Back in a moment. Okay, so I had to do a little bit of work off camera, so I got up to uh, level 271. Um, right, okay, so now we've got this. And what's that doing there? Let me just go down and hit it. Right, so um, let's cast away, shall we? Bloody hell. <laughs> Miles. <laughs> um... Right, so what I think I'm going to do is have a look under the water. Uh, and obviously we're looking for a shark. So have we gone to the edge of the map? Because that looks a bit crap, doesn't it, if I'm honest? So let's slowly reel it in. So it's 10% at the moment. Let's go 22%. So bottom right there, you can see... That the depth of it at the moment is um, six meters, and the distance away is thirty-five meters. So that's good to know. Right, how's it look there? What's that shadow? Yeah, this um, there, there it is a sodden shark. I'm having that. Well, I'm not, am I? But I'll try. Eh, yeah, sharky, sharky. So, I... Yeah, you can actually reel it in... ...from this camera angle. I don't think this is how it's meant to be used, as I think we're probably meant to have a float. Just dragging it along the bottom. Bugger it. Yeah, it's going to come out of the water any second. And where's the boat? Let's have a quick look on the map in a moment. You want some of it? Yeah, let's have a look on the map. Oh, look, boat. 
Um. Okay. So I think if I move a little bit and then press M, yes. Wait, how do I get to the boat? Yep. Ah, go, go, go. Oh, please say so that we can press and hold, enter the boat. Flip and excellent. Um, right, can't get on the boat with my rod out. Nice. Right, throttle is W. Nice, and it holds it as well, just like a real boat. Um, I think I left the handbrake on. Only joking. Right, so we want to go out into the shark-infested waters. Now we've mastered fishing. <laughs> Picking up speed. I wish I had a boat. I'll try and keep the prop under the water though. Right, we're going out to sea. Where the sharks are going to be in it. Oh, I didn't check out the rod stand either. So, when we finish doing this, when we've caught 20 sharks or whatever, we'll go and set up the rod thing. See how that all works. A depth finder would be good. Okay. Oh, they didn't put different sound in for reverse. Okay, so finish steering. Didn't mean to do that. Um, anchor. Now we're going back. And sinking. Right. Okay. Three. Right, not too far away. Yeah, there's a shark. There's another one. Try and tease them with it. My goodness. Come on. Here, boy. Come on now. Okay, so yeah, that is falling, unfortunately. So let's turn the drag up and see whether we can keep it. bit closer to the uh nice right yeah but we've got a bloody shark on it i don't care about the bait <laughs> come on mate over here please come on don't lose this johnny wait Oh, you f... The fish broke off. 
Oh, no, it's actually broken the rod. Oh. Well, that's no good, is it? Um... Okay, so obviously I'm not quite skilled enough to be catching sharks yet. Who would have thought it? <sighs> Progression. I'll get there. I'd quite like to see the animation and see whether he does that dead face. The dead eyes holding a massive shark. Right, careful with that one. Lionfish. Okay, we'll keep that. Because we need the XP. Right, okay. So, let's go and try the rod holder now. Oh. So, press and hold Q to reset. Okay. The real deal. Right. So, rod holder. <laughs> it's good. So if you do this in real life, you can really get some tilt going. If you're quick. Also, just standing in the middle of the boat and moving your weight from one side to the other, you can get quite a lot of tilt. Especially if someone's making a cup of tea. You should do that. Right, what did we hear? Shark? We seem to be crabbing now. Right, I don't think we're allowed to, to go to that island. So, I'll see you over there in a moment. Okay, so we've got the rod holder down. Um, I'm not sure how you set the... This thing up. So it just says unequip. So, I'm not sure about that one. But anyway, yeah, so this is a rod holder, so you can have three on there. And then that's the basic one that can only take one, of course. So yeah, that's pretty cool. So yeah, it's a shame that I don't know more about um, rods and stuff, because then I'd be able to... Uh... Oh, look, is that... Is that where it's got something on it? No, I don't think so. Yeah, because then I'd be able to go through and make the perfect setup. And go and catch one of them bugger sharks. But yeah, I just don't know enough. But if you want anything tested out, please feel free to let me know. So we'll catch one more fish. And then, yeah, I'm going to end the episode. Just knock that one with the rod. Oh, there's one more thing I needed to check. So, I go on settings and key bindings. Um, eagle eye. V. Right, V doesn't seem to do anything with the rod in the water. What about if I do... Nope. Yes, I don't know about that.
Of course, it's a meter depth. That's not any good, is it? Not for here. It's just dragging along the bottom. Right, okay, let's change the uh, depth of it to 30 centimeters. That went further than I thought it would. Anyone interested? Submarine, isn't it? Go on, mate. Go on. Nope. <laughs> okay, well, I think I'm going to have to end it here. So thanks for watching, everyone. Really appreciate each and every view. And if you've liked this, please feel free to join me in the next one. So, cheers everyone, and bye for now.